Government, according to Energy Minister Irene Muloni, continues to pay for surplus electricity generated with the associated knockdown effect on end user tariffs. The cost of electricity depends on how much you're generating, at what price are you generating, how much are you consuming. The more you consume it so that you're not paying for a lot of excesses, the better. And therefore, the reduction in the what? In the tariff. More so, reliable supply, however, remains a constraint for most of the local manufacturers who are often raising concerns about intermittent fluctuations and costs. Specifically for manufacturing, for purposes that this is a strategic area that is going to generate more production, generate more income, then we need to move those who are clogging that, uh, those particular tariff lines out of it so that more manufacturers can benefit from it. Further still, manufacturers say that continued weakening of the shilling against the dollar is sending their operations to a near halt. Because we are getting uh, quite substantial volumes in, um, in, um, in export trade, some of our members feel they can actually pay their bills in a currency that is not exposed to the, <coughs> to the fluctuations using their dollar revenues that they have earned. So if that initiative can be done, it can help to at least to stabilize the tariff as we move towards the five cents. These, among other concerns by this major sector, emerged during a meeting between manufacturers and energy minister Muloni on the sidelines of the ongoing Uganda Manufacturers Association annual trade show at Lugogo.